In this video, I'm going to do some tests and find out whether running this mainstay fire pit on your deck can cause any damage. The first thing I need to do is take a baseline temperature of the deck. And I've got this thermometer here, and as you can see, we're at about 74 degrees. So let's uh, get a little fire going here, and we'll see what happens. The first thing I want to do is check the legs and see if the heat from the pit is working its way down. And so far so good, we're at pretty reasonable temperatures, about 76 degrees. It's a little hard to see, but if you look real close, you can see that the laser beam is just to the left of the fire. And we're in the 300s there at the bottom of the pan. At the edge, it's really not that hot. It's under 130 degrees, and now the legs are warming up a bit. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go underneath and check how hot it is right under the bottom. And it was pretty hard to photograph, but I measured about 350 degrees. So now that I'm down here, let's check these legs again. And they're still pretty cool, but what I notice is that it's starting to get warm on the deck itself. The maximum temperature I read was about 149 degrees, and so that's about 75 degrees hotter than the deck that is not underneath it. But still, 149 is not enough to melt it, and it didn't seem to climb much higher than that, and I can touch it with my hands, so it's really not that hot. So in conclusion, I found that it is perfectly fine on my deck, and it never did get hot enough to damage anything. And the legs are a little warm, but it's not warm enough that I would get burned or anything like that. Hey, thanks for watching my video. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.